Hey folks, Charles Snyder here again. I am the marketing ninja. What the <laughs> okay, maybe not a real ninja. I did study uh, martial arts though. Anyway, in the last video I talked about not being a weirdo. You have to have a website, you have to have content uh, in the form of a blog, and you also need to have video content describing your products, your services, and your business. Have to have it. It's expected these days. If you don't have it, this generation, the, the millennials, and the next generation coming up, who've been plugged into the internet and websites and social media all their lives, are going to think you're a weirdo. Don't be a weirdo. You have to have a website, you have to have a blog, and you have to have video content. In addition to that, you also have to have a presence on social media. I'm talking about the big four, minimum, minimum, you need to be on the big four. Facebook, um, Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram. Yes, Instagram. Instagram uh, got bought out by Facebook. So a lot of what Facebook is doing is integrated into Instagram and vice versa. So it's one of the big four, it's part of the big four now. And in addition to that, you have to be indexed by Google. You should be on Google Plus. And there's a lot of other social media platforms out there that it doesn't hurt to be part of. And the more you are out there into that net, into that social media, the more your name is going to be presented to these people as long as your content's being shared. The way to get around that is paid advertising. It is okay to do paid advertising, and it is far cheaper and vastly more effective to do social media advertising as opposed to uh, Yellow Pages advertising. or advertising on the radio, and definitely advertising on the television. I've done it all. It's expensive as hell, and you can't target your audience. Social media, Google, pay, pay per clicks, uh, on any of those is far more effective and you can drill down based on gender, you can be uh, based on age, income, interest, location. The, the options are incredible. And you can get a far more targeted audience that is interested in your products and or services that way. So in order to build trust with that, with the millennials, the Gen Xers, you know, people like me, uh, even the baby boomers are getting into this. And if you don't have a website, you don't have a blog, you don't have content, people are not, they're going to pass you by. And unless you're building trust with those folks, they're going to pass you by. They're not going to give you their money. The way to build trust is you've got to get your name out there. And there's a couple different ways of doing it. There's, there's a lot of different ways of doing it. But let me just tell you right now, unless you're Amazon, Google, uh, Newegg, or uh, uh, Target Online, or one of these huge names that's known internationally, you're not going to get online sales. You're not going to have a website where people just come and give you money for your products or services. It just ain't going to happen because... The trust isn't there. You're not a household name. To build that trust, you have to go to the other end of the spectrum. You have to do something simple like getting a name, a number, and an email address so that you can contact that person back and talk to them about your products or services. That's how you build trust. Because people will not buy from you unless they trust you. And they won't trust you if they don't know who you are. Case in point, walk up to someone on the street, don't know who they are, never met them before, and um, ask them to do plumbing for you. Are you going to pay them a couple thousand dollars to do plumbing for you? You don't even know if they know anything about plumbing or car repair, electrical work, designing a website, planning your wedding. If you don't know who they are, you don't trust them, and you're not going to give them money. People are going to do the same when it comes to your business. 
If they don't know who you are, if they don't trust you, they're not going to give you money. Content, paid advertising, social media. Live it, learn it, love it. Charles Snyder, I'm out. Peace, yo.